Hey you, it's Jess here and welcome back to my channel. Today I am back. I didn't have any videos last week, but I'm back in the swing of things. I'm doing my weekly Erin Contra and Plan With Me. And we're going to be using one of my last... No, I've still got some winter kits left, but one of my last, like, you know, super wintry. It's called... Oh, what is it called? <laughs> Sweater Weather. It's an old Scribble Prints kit from last, maybe last year, I can't remember. Um, but it's just really pretty art. This is Baby It's Cold Outside. I've already cut up the washi to use Simply Gilded with. And here are the colours, the patterns, all that good stuff. Yeah, I've got everything here, so don't worry. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that's the kit we're going to be using this week. I've cut up the washi because I'm going to bring in this perfect match, Purple Mist. So excited to be finally using this. See how it perfectly matches. Yes. Purple Mist. Uh, I'm going to have I'm going to have very little foil this week. I'm just not in the foil mood except that I am going to be using the bottom gray purple um, row of Clever Gal Craft Hearts here. These are the classic hearts in silver. They pretty much perfectly match Purple Mist. And then, I don't know why, I'm bringing in lavender foil uh, glitter head overlays and boxes from Rose Colored Days. I just feel like the lavender foil will look really pretty with the kit and it's close to silver. It's not too outlandishly purple. So I'm going to be using those as well, and then that's, then the icons and things won't be foil, but, yeah. So this is my list of things. I've tried to, like, do a bit more planning of my week and get ready to, like, kill the week because I have not been having pretty good, I haven't been having very good weeks lately, and I need to just, like, get to it, you know? I need to stop messing about oh, that's a bit of sticker uh, I'm also going to be trying a different layout this week as well so that will be fun for all of us but first let's start widening out so I'm going to be widening out the bottom washi stuff so my white dad is not enjoying the blumps and bumps of my planner because it's getting pretty thick now, even though it's not even halfway through the year. Like what is making it like, it's just not enjoying the edge bumps here, but I'm going to white out all the, it's almost dead, that's why. I'm going to white out all the middle bits here and also the dates. Um, and then I'll be right back. I don't think you guys need to watch this at all. <laughs> okay, we're all whited out. And I thought while I'm doing this, I might as well um, update you on last week, considering that I didn't have a plan with me. And I didn't post on Instagram either. I just wasn't happy with last week's, like, spread, or I started filming it. And about halfway through, I just sort of gave up. I had no energy last week. I kind of just needed some time to myself, you know. So, I didn't show that. So, I thought I might as well, uh, yeah, update you. So, the week ended up okay. I didn't end up doing a lot of what I was supposed to. But I did a lot of drawing and planning. And uh, if you don't follow my Instagram, you should if you're interested in my art because I did post on there that on Friday I um, released some custom Fashion Girl slots in my shop. And these are not like the past ones that I've been doing. These are actually based on using a template. So I've drawn a normal girl and a plus size girl in this in the same outfit, in the same pose. Um, and this one was jeans and t-shirt and um, little ballet flats and doing a cute little wave and a wink. 
So that was what I brought out. And so basically it's a blank template except for the clothes and the face. And what you do is um, I would draw the hairstyle custom, which I think would be a lot easier than a whole um, fashion girl. And you could also choose all the colors and decorations. You can put patterns on the pants and t-shirt and things like that. So I think they will still come out really unique and interesting and different enough so that they're not like everyone and their dog is the exact same fashion girl. I also plan to do different poses, different outfits in the future. But I just released 10 of those on Friday. I don't know if they're still up um, because as of <laughs> I'm filming I'm like talking in the future I'm actually filming on the Thursday so um, and of course this goes up Monday so I'm not sure if there are any left but if there are definitely check out my Etsy shop if you're interested um, they're kind of they're the same price as my old-fashioned girls only because I still have to take the time and doing the hair and you know all the extras and um, I want to take you know but you'll still get like a high quality finish at the end and also I still had to make all the templates <laughs> but yeah so the next release um, I'm going to do one with the dress then the release after that is going to be Harry Potter Hogwarts students which I think I'll be able to do a lot more than 10 I'll probably do like a batch of 20 because um, I know it'll be popular and also I just I think they'll be easier because um, it'll just I won't have to like do the clo clothes detailing it'll just be choose your house and your hairstyle kind of thing and like your skin color and whatnot so I think that'll be alright that's what I'm gonna be trying to do like I get a lot of requests for custom fashion girls and I just I can't do them like full custom I just can't I know not everyone's happy with the template but because it's not full special for you but uh, it's the only way really to keep me sane while also doing everything else that I do uh, I'm gonna cut off the edges but some of the text might be too close so we'll see but I wanted to cut these into proper um, date covers. We'll see how it goes. This could be a huge disaster. I can even get the... Uh -huh. Alright, I think that works. If you don't know, this X-Acto knife is Slice brand. See there? And it's like the same brand as this one. Uh, that everyone uses but it's a nice retractable has a big blade and it's also a ceramic blade so which is nice I think that's the like highlight of the of the slice tool is that it's um, ceramic which is a nice strong cutty thing anyway <laughs> should be careful geez uh, so what else happened? So I released that. I started work on three autumn art sets and one will be out this Friday. Um, I started on my one of them but then decided that maybe it's just like two autumn for right now so I'm going to release my second set first because it's more like early autumn, less straight up all those crazy autumn colors am I cutting like right through the paper oh it doesn't matter because I um the next the next page is the notes page and I've uh I glued those together because I don't want to I just I just can't keep up with notes pages and I prefer if they were all the same so if I can't keep if I can't keep up then I'm just not gonna have them so that art set comes out this Friday. It will be Cozy Coffee Shop is the theme. I know there are a lot of coffee um, sets, but I know this is like particularly 
early autumn rainy kind of kit I know I think it'll be good I, I do wonder what people's opinions are of um what do you think of like when artists make the same kind of theme does that annoy you or not I know the clip artists we've kind of gone together to and like keep like tabs on what each of us is sort of doing so you don't double up too much because I remember a couple of months ago um, three artists brought out a mermaid kit like on the same week but I feel like all different kinds of shops use the art like not everyone I don't know actually if I care that much if the same theme goes out from the same from different artists because they're all going to be so different and I feel like we all serve as like different sometimes different shops sometimes the same but that took a long time sorry guys but let me know what you guys think I like that as like disconnected just a little even though it was very light it was worth it all right we're going to start building from the bottom up and we still got the full boxes. I'm not going to use that. These are all coming later. I'm going to use the checklist and the glitter headers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the glitter head, the checklist, all the way down the bottom here. Let's see what I'm going to do. Um, oh, I got to remember how I'm actually like. <laughs> I'm going to. Unless I should color block you guys. What do you think? Because we got a color blocking system here. So, alright, I'm going to color block. This is going to be nuts. I haven't done it in ages. Oh, not too long ago, being in. Alright. Might use tweezers for these checklist glitter headers. Alright, so we're going to put the checklist glitter header. Then we're going to put a full box down. And then another glitter header. And then have an extended today box. I think that'll be good. That's a good way to get a little bit of a checklist in. So we're using that on this side. Um, so I might use ooh, the mountains. One of my favorite poems is Mount Blanc by Percy by Shelley. If you didn't know, and it is a perfect example of sublime. Romantic sublime versus beautiful. Anyway, I did a whole essay on it once. <laughs> so I think I'm going to do that. And I'll also keep all my full boxes in a row like I like. But it gives me sort of this extended area for my daily stuff. But also giving me space for a little bit of to-dos. I'm also wondering whether I could do this with two checklists. Two heart checklists sometimes. Hmm. It's really just for those itty bitty things that I don't really want to put a whole sticker to, but I also don't want a whole um, check box. I know. Just like Andrea and half the people in the planning world, I'm trying to find what's more functional at the moment. I think that's just what happens in the middle of the year because when new planners and stuff come, come out, we have to all like. Get our crap together. <laughs> Figure out what the hell we're all doing. So I'm going to try this. This might be the best of both worlds for me. Right, I'm just going to go and put all these three in speed up and I'll be right back.
Okay guys, that is everything color blocked. I think that's looking really awesome. I'm loving this big block of space here. Of course, I don't have to do in this wide out, so we have to figure that out. But I think that'll work out really well. I'm just going to go off camera and um, put in my overlay, my lavender overlays from Rose Colored Days because they take a while. And then I'll be right back and we'll do the sidebar. Okay, the glitter adders are down. I'm trying to see if I can show you the purpliness. You can kind of see it there. Purple. I think it looks super cute. I know, I just I wanted to use purple today. I thought I would show you me doing this. <laughs> the full box overlays. I know not everyone feels comfortable about doing these. So, let's see how it looks like on the... Uh, I think it cuts off too much of the quote because Andrea perfectly arranges that. So, um, what, hmm, hmm, what one? What to use? I think it'll look really pretty on the mountain box because it's not... So just line it up in the bottom corner, then the side, and then I just lay it down. Not too bad. I think I'm going to put it on this little one here too because it's not too much important on the bottoms and sides and I'll just use the two for now excuse me alright so I'll show you again close up put it on the very corner just line it up Oop, and don't worry if you take a bit of ink because in the corner it won't matter line it up on the side there like you put in a full box down anyway it went down a bit crooked but that's alright there you go, you get the two lavender boxes, so pretty. I just thought you might as well try something a little bit fun. I only bought the lavender boxes in two styles. It might be have been better if I had another style to use, but that's okay. So we're going to zoom in and start doing our full boxes because we are done with those. And we're going to put in... Oh baby, it's cold outside. And it's funny because right now it's super windy and cold and wet outside. So perfect timing. That's the full boxes sheet done. And oh, we want the flaggy flag. And it's just a silver glitter. Nice. I've whited out the other flag because if you watch me weekly, you know that when I use deck covers, I don't like to have the other flag showing, so because I think it looks a bit funky with deck covers. So I think I want to bring in some of the skinny bow washi, at least just one length here of the Simply Gilded Purple Mist. I think I'm going to white out both of these lines just so they're, so they're gone. I don't know if you guys can hear the wind, it's pretty insane. I love it though. I have a little white gap here. There we go. I'm gonna just rip that off. Alright, that's all the purple mist we're gonna use this week, so let's put it back away in the storage. So beautiful. I actually think here it looks a lot more purple. It's like the perfect match for this gray. Yeah, what was I saying? I don't know. Gravy. Um, yeah, so last week was alright. This week we're going to do a lot more work. Oh, I just like tore the paper here. I'll just leave it. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> It'll be fine. No one will notice. It's just got a little flap. There we go. we'll tear the flap off so it's not so in your face or flappy. So, so pretty. Ah, simply gilded. Alrighty. Um, I also realized the checklist at the bottom, I might actually put things that I need to keep myself held accountable for, so I have to tick them off. I think that's what that's going to go there. So, Gonna list a lot of my sections that I want to be working on in my chapter work 
and my art as well. Uh, so this will be kind of like my homework area a la Kirsten plans. Um, Kirsten who is the best. I love her. I love her channel. <laughs> I'm gonna meet her in like a month, that's crazy. And I should remember, since it's, this week is a month until the planner party, I should probably take out my, um, countdown <laughs> to use. All right. Okay, now we need habit trackers. Put the blue one on top to separate that gray out a little. How about we do some separating, just a nice little white space in the sidebar. Alright, and then we're going to do dinners as per usual. I just like to keep track of my dinners. I don't like the idea of Millhouse having two spaghetti dinners in one day. So. <laughs> High five to anyone who gets that reference. I mean, Millhouse should give that away, but I, I say that line constantly for no reason. Because it makes no sense in actual real life. <sighs> That's really pretty with little snowflakes in there. Dennis! Um, how about we have a weekly list? Once again, I've only got, I'm going to put to do because it just doesn't line up, which is sad, but I will. Uh, yeah. There's that dotted line right in the white space, so these two are going to be connected, but whatever, it's to fit in the most space. And then we'll have the matching little to do checklist. That's pink. Oh, it literally just fits. Like, right. <laughs> so that is a perfect little sidebar with a little bit of purple mist. Purple mist. Alright. It's very hard to, like, not say things American because I watch so many Americans. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Um, I should probably get some dates, shouldn't I? Oops. I'll be right back. Okay, I just put some rose colored days silver date dots up there, so now we're nice and shiny. <laughs> um, but we're ready to plan out this week, and I, yeah, I have a few plans. Um, I'm gonna go work on Wednesday and Friday, and maybe one of the weekend days, we'll see. Just find it easier that way. Um, just because I have a few things I want to get done at home. So, Monday. First, I want to get into this routine that I should be talking about, but um, I'm just going to label out. I'm going to use these fancy labels. I love these, they're my favorite. I don't think I'm going to color block. I don't know, wait, should I color block literally the whole days? I might have, I might, I might do that. Oh my god, why? I'm insane. I might not have the same, um... Okay, basically, um, I've really been wanting to do yoga, but my, um, because I feel like it would just be a very simple workout to do. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And I might have time on Wednesday afternoon to do it, so I might put it down here because it'll be in the afternoon. There we go, put it here. Anyway, I wanted to start yoga, and um, ooh, am I gonna use? I got yoga girls in the pastels, don't I? Yes, I am going to use these. They're really cute. Yeah, from Fox and Cactus. Uh, but I have really sensitive knees, like, like seriously, 30 seconds on my knees and they freaking hurt. It's the worst. 
So I, uh, yeah, so, but, um, I know everyone loves yoga with Adrian on, um, YouTube, and she actually has a whole 30 minute routine for sensitive knees, so I thought I would give that a try, and maybe I can be doing, like, 30 minutes is a good yoga workout, I feel like, and it's not gonna, like, destroy my knees in, like, five minutes. Uh, because it's for knees that are like that and it's also for strengthening your knees so maybe in the future I can do normal yoga so um yeah so I'm going to be trying that all week just doing the 30 minutes a day um up until the weekend but I'm a bit busy and also because it's a bit hard to do in Lachlan City I don't know it feels weird to be doing it I also ran out of labels, so I think I'm going to do it more times a week uh, than four in the future when I'm using like three format which has more of these labels because I love these labels so I want to use them. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to be trying out the Yoga for Sensitive Knees this week. Just get the body moving. I'm considering joining a different gym so I might do that uh, the next week after. Hmm. Yeah, so gonna build things up so next week is sort of a this week is sort of a bridging week for me <laughs> so we're gonna do the week of yoga and then we're gonna go join the different gym because the uni gym is just it's got so much construction and like the women's change room and bathroom is gonna be in construction for ages and like well I'm not going <laughs> I'm not doing that so I'm gonna join a different gym in town uh, which might, which will be, you know, nicer than the uni one. Um, yeah, I'm going to do that the next week. All right. We'll make sure to put that in our to-do plans. So I'm going to do yoga, and I'm going to try and do it in the mornings. Except because I'm going to do uni on Wednesday. Um, yeah, so that'll be good. Uh, I've also remember I got videos, which, darn it. That's why this isn't going to work very well. All right. I want to put everything, these, okay, I'm just going to put the videos on the opposite side because I screwed myself. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to use the middle ones, a middle little thing, and I'm going to put this video up. Might as well do these, like, things that occur over the week all at the same time, you know? Let's save ourselves some time. So then on Wednesday, we got a haul going up. I, so I'm still subscribed to Simply Gilded subscription box. I have been from the very beginning. Uh, but this month it just got super screwed up. The May one, I still don't have it. And today it was wrongly um, delivered, like misdelivered in another state. And now I think it's coming its way to me. I have no idea what's happening with that. So I won't be hauling the May box. But I, I decided to send all of my mail for the future to my US address. Just all of it. So hopefully um, my hauling will be a little bit better. Still a little slow but better than it is now. Because OzPost is a mess. So I have to do's for there. Um, I do want to call my dad, so I might put a little, little um, appointment label in here. Just keep it all separate a bit. Cover up this part as well. And I think I want to use a little calling munchkin because I might as well use cute ones. Also, this entire sticker album is now full. I cannot buy any more munchkins <laughs> because it's full. Uh, I was doing like my lesser used ones at the back and then they kind of met up in the middle so oops recently well I should really I should I should probably say that my um I use a little blue much can a little blue phone I want to use my facetime ones just yet uh, I should say the Friday video will be my Erin Condren covers collection 
because my basics uh, planning is in limbo right now. So we'll, we'll figure that out. I could have a setup video coming for you. <sighs> I'm really just blabbering on this week. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Last week I was like super sad and down and quiet and this week I'm a mess. Just gonna get used to everything again. Uh, okay, so that's everything for Monday at the moment. I have something for my to-do list. I want to do some reading for an article I need to write, uh, which I need to pick the books up on Friday. Alright. Another plan me. Okay. The 19th. Uh, I just realized I'm going to call my mum as well. So that's calling my dad, but I'm going to call my mum on the Tuesday. I wanted to use the same icon. <laughs> And that one like matched so well. Ah. Let's use this ready pink one. It'll be fine. And then I might as well use the same. I'm gonna call my mom later though in the evening. So I'll put that down the bottom here. Okay, I just need those big and not my to-do list because I need to remember them. Alright, so call mom. Uh, it is also Etsy payday. So I might just use a skinny, oh I don't have a skinny label for grey. Oh I do in the glitter though. So I'm going to use this skinny label in the glitter. Put it here. And I'm just going to use the little, um, little double note, the little, eh, we haven't got too much dark purple on this side, so the little dollar sign right here, that little label. There we go, payday from Etsy. And then my main task for Tuesday is that I want to finish up, I'm going to use a silver glitter. I want to finish up my set for the Friday so it's just sort of I can get the Etsy listings done at my leisure and just put it up whenever. So I don't really use to mark that and I just realized they would be the same side but it doesn't matter. Maybe I'll put it up here so it's sort of yeah. Well of course I know what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to use my little art unicorn from Fox and Cactus. Oh, I love it. It's so cute. Leave that out. I'm on my second $2 Tuesday sheet. <laughs> okay, now Wednesday I'm going into worky work. So maybe I will actually like put in the work. I've got yes, three things I want to do that day uh, to keep me accountable. And to mark going to work. I'm just going to use this. I'm gonna use another fox and cactus little girl, but some pastels. I think I'm gonna use this. No, hmm. <laughs> Just trying to think. I think I'm gonna use these like wintry autumn girls in pastel to mark going to work. Um, I think I'm just going to use the ones with the buns. I'm going to go into work twice, so um, for now. I might go in on the weekend. Uh, so I'm just going to use those to mark work. And I'll just take them out now. Uh, yeah. Uh, I mean, there's the laptops, but I think I want to use a more seasonal sticker for work. So let's put you in there. Oh, so cute! this work and I have to go to the post office that's why I was looking at that other one maybe I can just use it in the white space I'm just going to use a little hot eyes one. Oh wait I was going to the post office because okay uh, this is conditional then Hmm, I think I'm going to wait and see because I was going to mail something to 
Monique, are you listening? Hello, Monique. <laughs> Um, I just say her name to get her attention, but uh, yeah, I'm supposed to be sending her some stuff and I don't know if that stuff is going to be in, in time for Wednesday, so I'm going to keep that for now. Keep it on the back burner, I'll put it in my to-do weekly to-do list, yes, so when it does come in, I can put it in. Alright, okay, Wednesday is done then, we got the haul and work, yep. So Thursday... It is one month until the planner party, so I think I should have done that before my yoga sticker. I'm going to have to do undo. Be right back. Alright, there we go. I just wanted to be able to have it on the top because it's important. Um, and I'm just going to put a little washi behind it with the dark grey ones, maybe this, maybe just this one, just right at the top. Still a little undoy, but there we go. Uh, and then we got one month till the planner party. Ah! I'm so excited, I'm getting all my stuff ready. Um, I'm going to be requesting a MyUS package this week, which will have all the goodies that I'm, well, the two goodies that I'm going to be giving away at the party. My special business cards and a sticker die card, which I'm pretty happy about. So I'm going to be giving those out, should be pretty good. I mean, not as impressive as other people, but I find... I was going to make some stickers as well, but I'm like, that's 100 sheets that I'm going to make. And I'm just not, I don't have that set up. So I'm just, uh, I got what I could manufacture with the, what I could afford. Basically. Uh, so one more to the party. I also ordered a mini tripod, the one that Mandy Plans uses to... So I can vlog on my trip easier. So that will be awesome. I can't wait. So I'm going to vlog the whole trip to Austin for you guys. I have that up. It's also my regular work payday. So I'm going to put in the little payday flag with the money symbol. Because I'm almost, almost out of these payday flags. And then we're going to be filming. Filming, filming, filming. So I'm just going to put this straight in the middle because we got the room. Which probably means I can move this other stuff down. Okay, there we go. That's close enough. Um, so now we're going to be filming, and I think I'm going to use some, um, I'm going to use some whimsical cat um, stickers because they go with the colors of this kit. And we just got a little film hashtag plan with me. I think it'll be really cute right in the middle of this half box. So cute. I haven't used any wontons in this spread. Oh well, I'll use wontons next week. That might be okay. But put those little babies in. Oh, I love it. She's so cute. She's got like the little tripod. Uh, I'll show you close because it's too adorable. How cute is that? It's me. <laughs> Except my hair is brown right now. Okay. And that's all I've got going on Thursday. And then I'll put in my to-do list the videos that I need to film and edit and upload. Just so I keep track of them there. So then Friday we're back into work. Wait, both days I'm going to work has pink. So I'm gonna to have to use the to use the same box. I'm gonna to have to use the glitter quarter box. But at least we've got these. Andrea thinks of everything. <laughs> there we go, work. And I got my to-dos for work. Oh, I also want to go to Target. 
Okay, so uh, in Target, I need to get some shoes and shade of three pink of these. Hmm. Maybe I just use in a, a thingy, a large appointment label. Yeah, so I need to go to Target because I need some shoes and maybe a bag for the Austin trip. So I'm going to put this. These are from a $3 Thursday from um, Scribble Prints Co. She doesn't do them anymore at the moment, but these are using some of my art. It's just a bag of some shoes. Just So I can write Target, but then I know. I can't remember what the hell I'm going to Target for. Um, just for the Austin trip and then for the New York trip because if I haven't said it, I'm going to New York in September for the SGS Planner Conference. I know I'm insane, but let me live my life. <laughs> I mean, like, once my thesis is done, i got to be like an adult. So I'm going to New York in September. So it'll be good to have uh, some flats, some booties, and a little side purse um, that I can use in Austin and New York. So I remember the Target. And then, uh, it's annoying because if I do anything like, the only thing with this format is if I do anything like that's social, I don't have any room to put it in here, but I guess that'll be okay. Uh, on Friday, I released the, I released the artwork and it'll be in. 10.30 a.m. so at my time I should realize I could get rid of the half box sorry half box put you back on the sheet and then I have these little new release labels from paper and milk really really pretty I think I have a pink that can go with it uh, and then I can put this in the bottom and then I might be able to fit in because I just wanted to cover up this um, white out but that might not be doable so put this little new release label here and then in the white space here I could probably fit something yeah so whatever social thing I do on Friday I can put it in here in the middle yeah, I think that'll work. I might move these shoes up. I don't know if this stuff will good. <laughs> I could use the undo. Just so there's a bit more space here. And okay, I'm just going to let that dry. Also, it's raining now. I don't know if you guys can hear it. But yeah, it's a beautiful freaking day. I love rain. I love cold, so it all works for me. And then this video is the Erin Condren cover collection. Okay. So Saturday I can use this uh, half box because I want to do, um, do some uh, you know crafty stuff. I want to print off some inserts um, and then I have to do some drawing for a thing for a person so this is gray so I'm gonna put this here another little label I will use a little art I unicorn I need to do some specific drawing work um, and during the course of the week I'll just be doing customs and stuff at the night time we could probably put these little shoes back on I'm just going to move them a little bit upwards. There we go. So now I have some like proper room in here. But I think it looks a bit weird. So I'm going to put a washi strip behind. Sorry if this video is like a bajillion years long. Thank you for sticking with me if you're still here. Um, so here we go. Now we, got, we can work with this little space here. But also... This new release won't be so like derp. I am 
in a cloud of nothing. There we go. <laughs> Much better and it's pink, so that's good. Alright, so set up inserts. I have munchkins for this. Yes, yeah, see I have change inserts. And then I have sort of a grayish cream one of the TN setup. Ugh. Uh, so I think that'll look good. Let's see how it looks. Mm -hmm. Put this up in the middle, top, and then this right beneath it. Yeah, I think that works. Change inserts, it's like a whole, whole thing. And I'll be drawing up here while I do it. So that'll be good. I think that's most of my plans for the day. Uh, what color is the movie marquee? It's blue, so I'm going to put this on Sunday night. Because that seems like the best time to put it. So here on Saturday night, I do want to try and have a bath. So, I have this bath because I don't have like a grey one. So I'm going to use blue. These are from Caress Press. I'm afraid I don't know if she's coming back. But uh, I still have some stickers of hers. She has some really cute stickers. So that was bath time on Saturday. Sunday we got the movie marquee. Uh, look at the thing for my to-do list. And then the main uh, event of the day is I want to request my US box. Um, I start grey. I realize that I have these sort of matching bows. Yeah, I'm gonna use the bow stickers from uh, one of Kirsten. Oops, I ripped this one. One of Kirsten's um, SPC free promo freebie. So I thought this would be perfect. Uh, eh. Because I probably will have like simply gilded bows in it. So I'm just going to put the top to be really cute and say request my US box. Uh, no flowers. And then the rest of the day I want to draw. So I'm going to use the last sparkly art box. And then we'll work on the next set to release the next week because I'm cruel. <laughs> uh, I'm going to keep all the sticker makers going. Because you didn't know, I started the three sets at the same time. I don't know if I said that now. Well, it's been a while since I said those things. Um, so yeah, <laughs> uh, they're, they're getting done. So I'm very happy about it. I'm trying to catch up on work before I'm like straight into chapter writing. So that is the current spread. It's actually pretty filled out because I'm micromanaging my life again. But in a completely different way, I'm not gonna, like... Before when I was trying to use a checklist, which was... It was a while ago now. It was this week and I just didn't do any of them. Because they were like silly things like dishes and stuff, which I just kind of do on autopilot. So this will be stuff that I have to do that day, you know. Keep myself accountable. So, yeah, wish me luck. I'm just going to quickly put on this uh, deco of the top, because I do like to be extra and have all the decorations on the whole planner. And then we will finish up.
right guys the spread is completely finished I'm loving this I just I love the colors and the art the purple mist the beautiful lavender foil it's just let's do a viv wiggle everyone ah oh, it's just so beautiful really feeling back into my plan and I can't wait to use this week get all my stuff done do my yoga Ah, oh, so excited for the Planner Party one month. Do you, please comment if you're going below, but obviously we... I'm sure we can chat elsewhere on the Facebook group or DM me. It's all good. I am planning things with people. So let me know. Just so exciting. Hopefully we have a good and productive week. I hope you have a really good week as well. Uh, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you next time. Bye!